at ease. Good afternoon and welcome to the White House. Members of the U.S. Military Academy's football team received some presidential-level accolades at the White House this week as President Donald Trump hosted the Army Black Knights in the Rose Garden. You fought hard. You came from behind and beat Navy for the second season in a row. The team was in the Capitol this week to receive the Commander-in-Chief's trophy, handed out each year to the victorious team in the annual Army, Navy, and Air Force three-way rivalry. The Army Black Knights secured the trophy in December with a 14-13 win over the Naval Academy midshipmen in a snowy battle decided by a missed field goal in the final seconds. President Trump had a lot of words of encouragement for the victorious Army football team, telling them that as good as they were on the field, he was sure they would make even better soldiers. I know that each of you will serve with the same commitment, determination, and character that have earned you distinction on the gridiron. You will be courageous members of the long gray line that stretches back to the earliest days of our republic. The trophy has been passed between services since the 1970s, first awarded by President Richard Nixon, and its return to the Military Academy breaks a 21-year losing streak. While the Black Knights get to take the hardware back to the Academy with them, the President got a memento of his own, a custom jersey for the 45th President. From the White House, this is Ben Murray, Military Times.